Good morning, and thank you for joining us here on ABC 7 News. A look at your weather in about a minute, but first, your local headlines. Yesterday, Tascosa High School hosted a highly acclaimed vocal group originally from Kenya and currently residing in San Antonio. Their repertoire includes opera, classical, jazz, music theater, pop, and South African music. The Mo Pai Triplets musical journey began at the Kenya Music Festival competitions. The triplets were then performing for numerous international audiences, and they started performing when they were just seven years old. When asked who is the best singer, they jokingly downplayed the competition and insisted they sound best when singing as one. Well, we could tell you, but you would wind up in a river. So. <laughs> No, but I always say that we sound best when we sing together. Yeah, yeah. so strength in numbers, right? Yeah, strength, strength in numbers. numbers. <laughs> Kenya to San Antonio and now to the Big Apple, New York City. The triplets have huge aspirations and are well on their way to achieving them. Now for a check of your forecast with Storm Search 7 meteorologist Corbin Vogus. Good morning, Corbin. Good morning, Johnny. Uh, it's a very cold day today. We did see the snow come to an end very early, so those totals were less than impressive, but got a lot of cloud cover this morning, a lot of cold temperatures, and a lot of wind out there as well. Temperatures are in the teens and 20s with winds sustained around 30 miles per hour. That makes a lot of us have those wind chills fall or dip into the single digits. Feels like it's four here in the Yellow City, feeling like nine up in Canadian, and negative four is your wind chill up in Clayton, New Mexico, so just make sure you're dressed in adequate layers today. We'll likely see the winter weather advisories expire pretty quickly before lunchtime and then the wind advisories expiring when the winds die down around noon and we'll end up with a lot of sunshine this afternoon with just very cold temperatures in the mid 30s. For your seven day tracker, it's going to be a normal day tomorrow. We'll have a cold start, not too bad in the afternoon, but fire weather returns this weekend and Monday before our next potent front comes through. The high of 45 Tuesday, but below freezing probably for 48 hours. Here at DNT, we are specialized.